Entrepreneur, investor, podcaster, and author Tim Ferriss is known for his healthy lifestyle and productivity habits. In fact, his book, The 4-Hour Workweek, alone has sold 2.1 million copies because his tips are just that valuable. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Amin Chopra, and in this video, I'm going to be going over Tim Ferriss' 5 tips that you can use to significantly boost your productivity. So without further ado, let's get into it. So the first thing that Tim says you should do every morning is start your day by writing down your intentions. He recommends a 5 minute journal which is sold by Intelligent Change and its main purpose is to help you figure out your day so that you don't waste any time. It's split into day and night so in the mornings you list 3 things that you're grateful for, 3 things that would make today great and your daily affirmations and at night you simply list 3 amazing things that happened today and how you could have made today even better. It only takes 5 minutes as the name states and it's also something that I look forward to start in the future. Secondly, Tim says to focus on doing the right things rather than doing things well. There's no problem with wanting to do something to a satisfactory extent. However, we do end up wasting a lot of time due to paying attention to small details that don't even matter. But if you focus on doing the right things that are actually important, you'll highly benefit from it because you'll be able to get way more work done. Next, you'll want to write down 3-5 to five tasks that are making you the most anxious or uncomfortable. The reason for doing so is because these tasks keep getting pushed back on our to-do list because we're too afraid to tackle them. And as Tim says himself, when in doubt, the most important to do is typically the one that makes you the most uncomfortable, often including a chance of rejection, pain, or failure. And so this method will ensure that you get things done rather than avoiding them. Fourthly, you'll want to make a habit of meditating every morning. Now this can be as long as you want, say 10 minutes, 15 minutes, or even 20 minutes. But the main point is to train the mind's control over emotions so that you can think clearly and focus on things that matter. In fact, Tim once said that most of the successful people he knows meditate, and because there's no harm in doing so, give it a go and see how it benefits your mood and productivity. Lastly, for number 5, this isn't much of a tip but are rather tools that Tim suggests using to make your work process a lot more effective and efficient. For focusing on tasks, Tim suggests using the Momentum extension in Chrome. For note taking, organizing, and archiving, he suggests using Evernote. And to keep from procrastinating, Tim uses the Pomodoro technique, which I've also done and made a video on which you can check out right here. So that's it for today guys, if you learned something valuable in the video, don't forget to smash that subscribe button, leave a like down below, and comment about a productivity tip that helps you be more productive. And as always, thanks for watching.